blessing to you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Please, those who are watching me, I would like you to listen to this very important uh, message. Uh, my name is Apostle Peter Daniel by the special grace of the living God. Uh, I want to greet all the Nigerians that uh, for the for the elections that uh, that took place on Saturday and uh, I pray that God will comfort everyone and help us to attain the place of success in the mighty name of Jesus Christ as I've said before uh, that uh, about the election some people were asking me I've said it in some of my video before what the Lord told me about the elections that is going to come People have asked me many times, I told them, about three times the Lord spoke to me that the person who is going to win will be, uh, uh, they, they will collect the, 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 they will reach the elections and give it to somebody who did not win. To be sincere with you, if you look at all my videos, you will know that I am not a politician, so I don't speak about anything, elections or whatsoever. But on this case, on this personal case, I see the need of uh, of, of uh, addressing the people of God about uh, about uh, uh, the elections, about the elections. Uh, I am not a type of. Uh, man of God that actually speak on the NAT politics or whatsoever. God sent me to the church. But nevertheless, God also always talked to me about what is to happen on election stuff. God personally spoke to me. I saw Peter will be win. That's the truth of the fact. And the Lord spoke to me that it will be rich. The election will be read. He told me three good time that it will be read. And I told you people, if you look at my former videos, that you should pray that they should not read the elections. And that is what is exactly happening now. I said the prophecy and it's come to pass. About two, three days ago, the Lord was telling me that they are reading it. The Lord showed me the way they are doing it. I neck. From the high neck office himself those who work with the high neck they collaborate with them in doing the things reading this uh, uh these things changing numbers forgetting that god's judgment is still there and the truth is that no wicked soul will go unpunished no wicked soul will go unpunished and when by the time god begin to discipline some people it will go to their generations to their children to their grandchildren because our god is a god of justice and we never fail in the judgment though we know that it is the end time the end time will carry a lot of things like this we know that in this end time like this uh, some things like this will happen yes we know about this something will, like this will happen if it doesn't happen it means we are not yet in the end you see you see we know about that but the fact of the fact is this it is better to do things in the right way than to do it in a fraudulent way uh i want to i want to proceed the child that they should seriously be praying because there's a great there's there's a big possibility that there's going to be a war a big war in Nigeria, there will be protest, which can lead to revolutions. Yes, there will be protest, which can lead, which can lead to revolution, which can lead to a serious matter, killing of each other. So, for these reasons, I will personally address the people of God that they should be praying very well. And those who are coming to the camp from the outside, I mean from the people like uh, from the country like uh, U.S., uh, London, whoever, they should prepare on time and also contact me before the, 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 the board a ticket or coming.
let everyone that is coming outside the country coming to the school of heaven to the camp to contact me first so that i can tell them you can come do come now you can come now do come now so that it will be a kind of safety for them that is why that is one of the reasons why god was telling people to go to the camp his camp so that you can be there the camp of refuge by the time the war starts, you will see what is called hunger. Because everywhere will be closed up. Completely closed up. Serious. And I want to I want to advise those who are in a nearby country like Ghana, Cameroon, uh, nearby countries, to quickly esteem to be in the camp of God. To be in the camp of God before anything brought out. Because the mystery of Nigeria is just happening. The truth of the fact is that the old world, world war is still on the ground here. Things are happening everywhere. And where God has chosen for his people to be safe is the camp of God that God is asking you to come now. And I've given you a time of us at March 10 for this batch that at March 10, from now to March 10, make sure you are there so that you can do the screening and that you can, you can, uh, you can join the people in the camp. So I, you, 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 you might be seeing some message on your phone from my secretary giving you the requirement list. Yes, because uh, my secretary will be testing you now. For, I mean, those who have already contacted me on WhatsApp, uh, uh, but my secretary is contacting them too, mess testing the message. So if you didn't see uh, my secretary testing you, probably you have contacted me before. You can kindly WhatsApp me so that I can, you can WhatsApp me and send me your name so that I can tell my, uh, my, my secretary to send you a requirement list for the camp. There is a holiness street requirement list. You are not coming here to pay for school or whatever, but there's a requirement that you will personally need or so ever. So I pray the Lord will help you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So make sure that I'm advising those who are in nearby country like Ghana and Cameroon or whatsoever and in Nigeria to quickly be in this in the in the in, in, in the street center before. 10th of March so to be there on time before anything broke out in Nigeria before anything broke out at all in Nigeria so make sure that you are there so the Lord will help you in Jesus name the plans of Satan is to make sure that things he wanted to create a kind of blockage on every hand so that you will not be able to access Nigeria so that whatsoever the, 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 you, you can be camp where you are there you can be stopped, you can be hindered where you are there. So I pray the Lord will help you in Jesus' name. So make sure that you make a serious and fast. Don't joke with it. Don't wait too long. Don't say that, uh, let me wait for a while and see what is going on. By the time things begin to happen, all roads will be blocked and you will not be able to come to the camp any longer. So make sure that you make the step on time, do everything on time, take the necessary step so that you can be there and be safe in the camp. I pray the Lord God Almighty, we usher your step and be with you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Please, I want to also advise the youth of Nigeria that are listening to me, don't involve in any protest. Don't involve in any fight. If other people are protesting, you don't go because it will lead to bloody. So be careful. I pray God will help you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. God bless you. I remain Apostle Peter Daniel. If you want to join the camp, let me know, WhatsApp me, test me, and the Lord will be with you in Jesus' name. The camp is very safe and is being protected by God. God bless you and God be with you. Shalom. Bye. Blessing to you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Please, those who are watching me, I would like you to listen to this very important uh, message. And my name is Apostle Peter Daniel.